to commemorate the Day of the African Child, UN Radio Miraya in Juba, South Sudan, gave children the airwave, allowing students to co-host as radio announcers. The broadcast started with the usual, you are listening to Radio Miraya, Voice of Peace, tagline for the UN Radio. The children who came from different schools in Juba started their broadcast early in the morning with the breakfast show, a two-hour program. They also read the news. Radio Mira News Summary. I am Anok Arup. A child advocacy group is urging the public to ensure that children's interests are always put first. The Community Empowerment for Rehabilitation and Development says the Day of the African Child commemorated today should be used to highlight cultural beliefs and practices such as early marriages that are affecting children. Susan Paul, one of the co-hosts, said that it was her first ever experience on air. This is my first time to talk in radio, so I learned how to talk in radio because on first I was fearing, I thought that if all South Sudan can hear my voice, which, which is even making me to fear. So I hope this morning I did not fear. So I was just talking free. The children read messages concerning children's safety, especially on children's rights in times of armed conflict, and the need to have children grow up in secure, loving family environments. I let them know that today is the African child day and they should have to respect the child. They should let the child make their own decision and they should provide them all with their rights. Like the right to quality education, right to eat, right to play, right to talk and freedom of speech actually. Ratomel Petrovic, chief of Radio Miraya, said that children should have great time and have their voices heard. This, this was a way to appreciate the children, but also to raise awareness of, of their needs and of the time and special attention that we have to give to them and that we have to spend more time with them because they're the future of this country and this continent and our world. The event continued with lots of entertainment by the children and the performance by the United Nations Mission in South Sudan military contingent who participated in an outdoor celebration commemorating Day of the African Child.